there's just so much room for activities <laughs> Hello gorgeous people, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on and watching another video. If you're just stumbling across my page now, thank you so much for stopping by. I would super appreciate if you could go down there and subscribe to my channel for more hauls because... <coughs> World's worst drum roll ever. <laughs> we are doing haul week and I am... So excited, like so excited for whole week. I've never done one on my channel before and I thought if I can't do one in lockdown then when can I do one? So we are here doing a haul week and we're kicking it off with a massive in the style haul. I've got so many bits to show you and I'm so excited for it because I just am. <laughs> I've decided that throughout this haul week I'm gonna try and mix it up a little bit on my channel. So normally when I do my hauls I sit down, hold up the things, talk to you about it. And then I kind of thought, I was like, how much of like the clothing do you actually see? Like how helpful is that? I've been watching Emily Philpot for like, God knows how long now, like a long, 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 long time. And she does her hauls where she stands up, wears the clothes and then puts a picture up of the model on the screen. And I thought, that is such a good way of doing hauls. So I'm gonna give her credit where credit's due and I'm, pinching the idea a little bit so thank you love you <laughs> sorry <laughs> hopefully my hauls become a little bit more informative for you which i just hope helps because i just want to help you all to live your best shopping lives do you know what i mean so straight on into the first item then i picked up this dress from in the style obviously <laughs> great start Ashley but yeah so I picked up this dress and it is one of the ones that's got a big gathering detail down the side of it so it goes all the way down each side it's midi length I'll show you the bottom in a minute but it is a really like bodycon dress with a ribbed let me show you can you see that it's like the ribby material, excuse my orange fingers, I'm so sorry. But yeah, it's a rib material um, bodycon, so it is really like sucky in, but it's super flattering, it's so comfy, so soft, so I absolutely love it. I actually really, really like these, just like cutting about the house in, on just a day-to-day -day basis, when you want to make yourself feel like a little bit more like done up, a little bit more glam, but you're not going anywhere because nobody can. Did that just rhyme? Huh? <laughs> cute these are just so like effortlessly just make you feel done up make you feel a bit better about yourself when actually you haven't really tried whatsoever um but they're so flattering as well i absolutely love the shape of them but it's still like breathable like where it's ruched there is a lot of material so i don't feel like i'm being like completely sucked in at all so i'll just show you the bottom of it as well so that you can see the length and like the detailing down the side quickly but this is what it's looking like so you can see the detail that goes all the way down the side is like just below the knee. Don't be deceived about this though because it's not actually a drawstring. It does just tie up at the bottom. But it does have that like gathering ruched detail all down the side. And I think it's super flattering. So I'm so happy with this. And I'm so glad as well because I actually got it in another colour as well. So I also picked it up in a stone colour. Let me just show you. A bit easier, isn't it? That's why we do a haul. So I also picked it up in this colour as well. So it is like this stony, kind of more browny colour. This with a tan. Oh my goodness. So flattering. I love this colour so, so, so much. But yeah, like I say, they're just so effortless and just so stunning to wear. I'll show you this one on quickly. Are you ready for the sick transition? Ready? <laughs> I can't, I can't even like take myself seriously doing a transition like that, it's just not, I can't do it. But yeah, so I'll show you this one up close as well. So this is like, again, that really nice ribby material. Obviously because it is exactly the same dress but just a different colour. But I absolutely love these. I could do with like one of these in absolutely every single colour. Not gonna lie, they are a little bit difficult to get on and off because there is quite a lot of material with it being like all the midi ruchy situation. But I really love these. I think they're so flattering and so nice. So yeah, I'm really, really happy with these. So the next two bits that I wanna show you are the bits that I'm actually most excited about, I think. So I picked up two jackets. The reason I keep on looking over there is because they are over there. I'm not just being rude. <laughs> but yeah, so the first one is this really nice teddy jacket. And oh, Oh my goodness, it is the most coziest, 
coziest jacket ever it is so warm so snuggly like i literally feel like a little teddy bear in this i'm sorry but how cute this with like a little hot chocolate by the bonfire watching the fireworks it's gone past fireworks night so watching the christmas lights i've got something in my eye but yeah, do you know what I mean? You can feel the vibe that I'm going for. Maybe not with this dress. I mean, you could rock it, a pair of chunky trainers. But how cute. Like, I am in love with this. It is so warm. Like, I'm literally starting to sweat already. It's not okay. But it's good for the weather outside. But I'll just show you up close quickly. Look at that material. How stunning. Cute little collar. And obviously, the main thing the pockets like we are here for the pockets on this channel <laughs> i don't know what that was <laughs> but yeah so it is so cozy i absolutely love it the lining inside is like why did i think plastic then it's not plastic what is this material like do you know what i mean is that like is that helping <laughs> Right, you know what it is. That's just like normally inside jackets, isn't it? But yeah, it's so cute and so cosy and I just love it so much. I'll give you a little twirl. Do, 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 do. Maybe this is why I don't do my try on hauls like this because I end up just dancing around and flailing about everywhere. Let me know if that is a bit annoying and we'll go back to the old way. But anyway, this is the jacket and it is stunning. Like this is getting hung straight up in there this oh 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 mm. so the next jacket i picked up then i don't know who i'm trying to be in this because i know everybody has one and it makes them look really classy and i thought i'm gonna give that a go but i picked up a trench coat now i'm gonna be honest with you as i always am i'm a, like a, not sure on the material of it like, it doesn't feel like, I thought this was going to be like a proper, like, chunky coat. Like, one that I can literally wear as a proper, proper coat. But this is, like, really thin. Just almost like shirt, you know, like the shacket thinness. This is probably actually thinner than a shacket, to be honest. Um, so, what do I actually look like? <laughs> I can't, I can't. Let me just um, show you a bit up close. It's just a little bit big. It's a little bit big. Like I could fit another human in here. And I went true to size. I went for a size 8. And I don't think it's meant to be oversized. Um, but I could fit a whole other human in here. So if you are looking for this. Then definitely size down. But I'm going to be honest. This isn't what I was expecting. Have I just got. Have I got really long arms? I don't know. But yeah. It comes to like. Cuts me off there. I'm, I'm not going to lie. I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling it. I'll show you the bottom of it. <laughs> so this is what we look like. Do you know what I mean? That classy vibe that I was going for. I think that's long gone. I think that's long out the window. We've got a little slit. Oh. Cheeky. Yeah. Don't think I'm going to keep this one. <laughs> Do you know what I feel like? I literally feel like that time when I went into the school uniform shop with my mum and they put you in a blazer. Your first blazer, when you go into year seven, you put it on, but they buy you one that will last you until year 11, until you leave that school. And you walk into school, everybody in their first day with like these massive blazers like this and they don't know where to put themselves because everything's too big for them. That's literally what I feel like. Oh, you win some, you lose some, don't you? You win some, you lose some. Let's get this off. I thought I was going to be a classy bird for a bit. <laughs> so, speaking of classy birds then, please tell me that you know where this quote is from. Literally, it's the one and the only GC. You know, when she's like, I'm claustrophobic, Darren. <laughs> and I think, when was it? Was it in Big Brother? I'm not sure, but she's got a lot of one-liners, doesn't she? And I thought... Let's get one printed on me. I absolutely love this. This is from her collection within the style. And it's just a statement, isn't it? This is the most cosiest, like, 
it's just so snuggly so warm and i just thought you know what there's like no time where you can ever have enough jumpers so here we are i thought i'd pick another one up i got it a little bit more oversized i think i picked this up in a size 12 because i wanted it to be baggier i do prefer jumpers especially like this like sweatshirts i like them to be like really oversized really big so that i can like whack them on with like a pair of cycling shorts maybe not in this weather but you could i mean this is warm enough big pair of chunky trainers and then you can even even stick that um jacket over the top vibe and on the inside as well it's that nice and fluffy like sweatshirt material so it's super cozy and super warm and that's all we want isn't it in life it's like thick enough to keep you warm but thin enough that you can wear over a coat no you don't want to wear this over a coat it's thin enough so that you can wear it under a coat. There we go. And then to go with it, I also picked up these trousers. So these are some black high-waisted trousers, which you can't see any of at the moment. Um, let me just move you on down. But yeah, these are the black trousers that I picked up. These are the most comfiest flared black trousers that I have ever worn like i've been wanting some of these for so so long they're so flattering as well where they're so high-waisted because my belly button's like down here so i mean they're not mega high-waisted but they're high-waisted enough um but these i can't get over them as soon as i put them on i was like i am in love these are just incredible they're so soft they are like more elasticated at the top than when they like go out at the bottom as the flare um so they are quite tight at the top they're quite elasticated but not enough that makes me think like oh like where's my thighs gone they're still super comfy so for me this is just like a perfect outfit to make me feel like i'm super cozy in the house but still like i've put a little bit of effort in if that makes sense but yeah i cannot these trousers i think are my favorite mm, i do really like those dresses no these trousers are definitely my favorite find from in the style in this haul i literally I can't get over them they're so comfy i really really like them especially with this outfit so let me just let me put that teddy bear coat back on yes see this is a vibe oh yeah with the black flares as well loving it now this with a big pair of chunky trainers oh that is a bit of me yes oh i love this i love this i love this i love it the next piece I picked up then is this loungewear set. So this is from the Lorna Lux collection. This, I am so happy with the jumper. I really, really like the jumper. I love the like back wing situation that's going on underneath here. But yeah, I really, really like this. It's just super cozy and just like perfect for lounging about the house in. I don't know why, but this is giving me all like super cozy, snuggly feels. What do you mean I don't know why? It's because it's so soft. Literally, what am I on about? The only thing is, is the shorts. Now, they're a little bit see-through. Like, quite see-through. So, I'm not going to turn around. You will see, like, the colour of the underwear that I am wearing. So, I'm not the biggest fan. They are quite short as well. Like, my bum is out. So, YouTube just doesn't need to see that. So, I'm not going to be turning around. Um, I'll just show you quickly what they do look like from the front though. So don't get me wrong, they are super soft. Like I really like the little detailing around the bottom of the shorts. They're exactly the same as this material. So they are super cozy. It is just the see-throughness and the shortness that I'm not a massive fan on. Because I mean, don't get me wrong, when I am lounging about, I do want like my body covered up. Like I want to feel snug. I want to feel like cocooned, like a little baby back in the womb situation like i don't want everything hanging out like things falling out and butt cheeks just out mm, it's just not a bit of me so i just wish that they were like a tiny bit longer and a little bit more see-through and that would have been happy days so i'm going to keep the jumper but the shorts going to go back because this is super cozy appreciating my little wings Woo! push the boat out a little bit with this one I've gone for, is it PU or PV? I think I'm thinking of PVA glue, aren't I? Is it PU? That like, this material. Shiny Rain Mac situation. Now I actually really quite like what it's looking like on camera. And I am actually coming around to it. Because when I first put it on, I was like, oh my goodness, like do I literally look like I've got a Rain Mac on? But now... I think this 
with some thigh high boots could be a massive vibe even if i like open it up a bit and had like a black little lacy bra on underneath maybe i would just bang my elbow okay okay i think i'm actually coming around to it it is really quite short so i'd probably just wear some like little black hot pants underneath it just to be safe so that the old butt cheeks don't fall out but you know what i'm actually coming around to this now let me show you the bottom so i mean it is quite short but i could easily get away with this like i'm happy to go out like this what do we think i'm not sure if i like it or not i don't know like the more that i'm wearing it the more that i'm thinking oh is this a bit of me? I really can't make my mind up about this one. Um, the good thing is, is that it doesn't smell of fish. You'll know what I mean if you brought something this material before. So I had a pair of leggings, I can't remember where I got them from, but I got them out and I was literally like, Ugh. like they just smell of pure fish. So the good thing is, is this doesn't have that like fishy smell to it. Do you know what? Like, I hope I don't sound like an absolute weirdo here. I hope you know what I mean. But yeah, so they don't smell of fish, which is good. And on the inside, it is just a really soft material. So you don't feel like you're all sticky on the inside as well. You know what? I bought some boots. I can't remember if they're thigh high or not though. But let me just put them on and I'll show you what they look like. I didn't really buy them to go with this outfit. Because when I'm thinking thigh high, I'm literally thinking like thigh thigh high in like a big stiletto heel. But I bought these as like a cutesy like autumnal boot. So these are them and then they've just got this like, nice little buckle detailing on the side there, which I thought was really, really nice. I do really like these and I think the heels are good size as well because it's a block heel too, which just makes it so much easier for walking. But they do look quite high as well. Oh, I'm hoping they are. Let me just get some socks and we'll try them on. Oh, I'm excited for these little boots. I love a good autumn thigh high boot. Love that. Okay, we've got a little bit of a situation with the boots. I ordered the wrong size. <laughs> For some stupid reason, I've picked up a size five and I'm actually a size six and I don't even know why I've done that. Because these like, I'm really annoyed at myself because these are gorgeous. Like I actually really, really like these. So I'm fuming at myself. Why did I do that? I don't know. I've just gone to try and put them on and I can't get them on my feet. So yeah, what a surprise there is there. But otherwise, I really, really like these. Um, but these are actually the last thing that I picked up. So that is absolutely everything that I picked up on the In The Style haul. First haul of haul week, tick done. Oh my goodness, how exciting. I'm so, so, so excited for haul week. I really, really hope that you enjoy it too. Let me know what your favorite piece was down below. I keep hearing myself squeak as I'm talking to you. I'm like, eh. But yeah, I'm going to have to go and take this off now. But do let me know what your favourite was. I really, really hope that you stick around. Make sure that you subscribe so you see the rest of the whole week. And I shall see you in my next video. Bye. Mwah.